In this lesson, you will learn about comparing decimals. So if we have, I like to use a, a decimal chart, a place value chart to compare. It helps, it helps see where the decimals lay. So if we have the fraction, or the decimals, the decimal zero and five tenths compared to zero and three tenths. Okay. So I'm going to put that on my decimal chart. We have zero ones, we have decimal point, and we have five tenths. Okay. We're going to compare that to zero and three tenths. So there are no ones. I'm going to start um, to, from the left. I compare the ones first. The ones are zero, so that doesn't help me. So I go to my tenths. So I have five tenths or three tenths. In this case, there five tenths is more than three tenths. You can think of this as money as well. If you put a zero here, this would be 50 cents and 30 cents. I'd rather have 50 cents than 30 cents. So 5 tenths is greater than 3 tenths. Remember the big open mouth goes towards the bigger number. The small dot, or the small point goes towards the smaller number. Okay, let's try another one. How about 0 and 2 tenths compared to 0 and 9 hundredths? Many people see this and go, oh, that one's bigger. 9 is bigger than 2. Well. Let's put it on the, on, the, on the decimal chart here. So we have zero and two tenths. I'm gonna cross these out so I don't look at them. And we have zero and nine hundredths, okay? This is more like 20, this is 20 hundredths or like 20 cents. This, however, is only nine cents. It's nine in the hundredths place. So if we look, 20 is actually larger than 9. 20 hundredths is larger than 9 hundredths because it has 2 tenths and 9 hundredths has 0 tenths. So 2 tenths is actually greater than 9 hundredths because there are 2 tenths in, in 2 tenths and 0 tenths in 9 hundredths. Let's try a couple more. How about 5 and 36 hundredths? compared to five and 63 hundredths. So we put the ones down first, decimal 36 hundredths, five and 63 hundredths. So the ones are the same, that doesn't help us any. We're going to go to the tenths place. The tenths place, this is three tenths and this is six tenths. So this is really as far as we need to look. Six tenths is greater than three tenths, so five and 63 hundredths is greater than five and 36 hundredths. And again, if you think of it as money, five dollars and 36 cents is a lot less than five dollars and 63 cents. Let's try one with thousandths. Zero and we'll call it 37 thousandths compared to, oops, sorry, that's 37 hundredths compared to zero and 436 thousandths. So we'll put it in here. Decimal, 37 in the hundredths place, zero and 436 thousandths. Cross those out. So my zeros and the ones are the same, so I go to the next number. The next place value is tenths. Three tenths is less than four tenths. So 37 hundredths is less than 436 thousandths because the tenths are what we're comparing first and three tenths is less than four tenths. And that's the end of our lesson on comparing decimals.